guys, today I take the topic about the remote into the router switch or ASAs of the Cisco device by the ATTP. So the previous video I already talking about the how to do the telnet and SSH to remote into these networking device uh, using the Cisco command to that. Okay, so I don't really have concept about that, uh, but I have the lab for you and let's go to the uh, uh, configurations. Uh, so right now, uh, this is the uh, CLI mode in my router. Uh, uh, I have the IP configurations that I have pre-configured. So IP in the first brief, as you can see, is that uh, I have the IP address is the um, here, one hundred one six eight dot zero dot one. So the scenario is very simple. This is my router here. And this is my PC here, the PC that I'm, um, that I'm using. I direct connect like this. Okay. So on my prom side, I oh sorry, I have to type CMD here. Um, you can see this is my uh, CMD window. I can ping to this IP address my router. Zero one here. You can see the ping is working just fine. Okay. So right now I'm going to configure how to do the HTTP on uh, the router the first thing you have to enable the HTTP server IP HTTP server okay and IP HTTP um, we can uh, put the secure server here okay secure server if you want to enable the HTTPS to secure between the sessions when you want to remote control and you have to type the username um actually it's my name so here all right <laughs> and the previous password is 15 and the password is could be uh, cisco for example and then i'm going to say ip http authentication okay authentication is going to be local because i don't have the aa mode i mean ethanol server i have only the local database so i use the local here okay so this is uh make sure i verify this a little bit Oh, I'm sorry. Um, HTTP. Okay. So, okay. Nice. Okay. So, I have done the configurations on the router. Let's go to my, uh, here, my Firefox. I'm going to type the IP address of my router here. One and two. All right. The one six H. Dot zero dot one here. Uh -huh. It say trouble. Let's check it out again. One nine two one six H. Dot zero dot one here. Uh, oh sorry. One. Uh, it should. It doesn't support the HTTPS. So I'm going to type HTTP. Oh, okay. HTTP. Okay, it's gonna prompt me the username password. This is the username uh, that I type at the moment. It's my name, Pat. And the password is going to be the Cisco. Okay, so you can see, uh, I don't want to sell. Okay, you can see this is the uh, kind of the uh, web prom. I don't know. Alright, we have the level here that you can access. So I want to access to 15, which is the last level, and I can uh, go to the config go mode. Config mode. So config mode uh, is a lot of command here, at least that you want to uh, do the configurations. For example, like I want to show the route on the routing table. And so IP route here, a stinter, and you can see that it from you, it show you the 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 route that this is my router here. This is the that I connect here and this is the link of my router is the 192.168.0.1 here and exact mode is the most that we can monitor a lot of things like um for example like eh, can I say so clock okay ah you can see that we already we also can so clock here in my router and yeah a lot of command here you can uh do on the HTTP yeah, uh, this is the concept of HTTP and how to do it on the Cisco router. 
yeah help you guys enjoy hey, i can't see the platform here oh my god this is great here you see yeah and so ip interface brief you can see this is the interface uh, of my router nice so uh that is the thing that how to do the remote control using HTTP. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you very much.